one of the most uh, interesting and sought after topic in business is strategy there's a lot of work done on this a lot of good reading material written but what I see is that my experience has told me that strategy does not exist without execution there is no point trying to have a strategy when the execution is not in line or the execution has not been thought of so what is um, strategy and what is execution so let's try to differentiate into the two think of a house think that uh, you're trying to construct a house you know, for yourself and uh, for your family yeah now you'll obviously first um, think about your budget resources and all that and then what you can do how much you can stretch and then you'll contact an architect the architect is a person who gives drawings and uh, kind of you know the translates your thoughts into some kind of a workable drawing uh, which gives you a look of look and feel of the house he uses his own tools for that and then there is the masonry which is done to to give the house a shape you can think of the masonry as execution and you can think of the architect as the strategist important role of both of them because without the plans or what to be done or the drawing behind or what uh, kind of material to be used or what kind of uh, piping to be done or what kind of ducting to be done or what kind of um, foundation to be laid without all that the masonry is useless but having done all this if the execution is flawed the strategy would never translate into action and you would not have the house that you wanted to build the so strategy does not exist in separation of execution though a lot of people try to do that a lot of governments try to say that we have met great plans but the failure is in execution but it can't be bought into because strategy cannot exist without execution now let us look at what is strategy therefore I'll break this into two so what is strategy and what is execution and how the two combine together now if you look at strategy it's like an organization is here now the present scenario of the organization and this is where they want to reach the way the organization navigates to reach from here to there is known as the strategy of the organization how do you plan to go from here to there what are the businesses you want to get into so strategy would typically answer what are the businesses you want to get into what are the products what are the markets what is the production capacity or the production strategy you want to outsource how much you want to subcontract how much all those aspects how what are you going to do R&D on what are you going to how are you going to manage your supply chain all of these are aspects of strategy if you want to go from here so there are certain achievements you have got certain numbers here at the end of the year or the and this is a goal how do you do that having thought through all the aspects of strategy strategy aspects are largely that there, there can be a lot of analysis done a very good analysis to reach here you know organizations talk of pestle analysis organizations talk of uh, value chain analysis organizations talk of SWOT analysis several of them and all of them are important it's important to look at how the environment moves it's important to look at how your business value chain is getting affected it's important to see how competitors are going to behave once all of these kind of various analysis are done you have all the ingredients to make a good strategy but remember a good strategy is largely on paper you have to ultimately translate that into action now strategy making you would normally see a, a three to four day huddle and out comes a strategy but mind it how do you execute on that strategy this is a year-long issue 
year long or even long term more long term than that what are the kind of people you need to have to execute the strategy what are the capabilities the people need to have or how do you build those capabilities what are the kind of processes what are the kind of investments what are the kind of uh, projects that you need to undertake what the kind of uh, what how do you get the finances and how do you get all of these aligned and so that they can work together in a coordinated fashion to deliver on the largely achieved strategy now see one one side here is that while the strategy is a very exciting bit of it it is a 3 to 4 day thing and as execution is a year long thing keep this is to be kept in mind the other thing which needs to be very which is very important and needs to be kept in mind is that you cannot have a department which looks at strategy which is separate from execution i have seen lots of organizations which try to look at this differently but strategy without execution doesn't make any sense now it might so happen with the existing systems there is a certain amount of revenues or um things which organization can achieve so an organization therefore as a part of execution needs to go into m&a to achieve the balance of it but these are all parts of execution very often i have seen senior leaders get over involved here and their involvement here is much lesser as a result of which plans do not translate into action and that leads to wasted effort and wasted time this doesn't come back so if you get your strategy wrong at some point of time and your execution wrong it, it takes the organization back several steps strategy and execution is it only relevant in business it's relevant everywhere you have a vision for where your child would be once he's grown up so then you put him through now now that might be a vision you have think, thought through you have seen his capabilities and what he's interested in and all but remember it might be a 15 year execution 15 year execution cycle to actually see the child achieve to reach that destination and and this every parent knows how tough the cycle can be remember this is the story of execution on the other side you might have your financial plan in place you know what you want to do how much you want to achieve where you want to go how much money you want to need at what life stage but while this is the strategy side of it strategy side of your financial plan the execution again we all know how short term demands on funds often skew our own planning so execution of strategy as it is difficult in organizations it is difficult in personal life but at the same time strategy and execution is something that you do in any case what you need to do is that for your own organization have a very robust execution and strategy model linked together and ensure that there is no one who separately looks after a strategy and advises others on execution or who separately looks after execution and advises on strategy the two are interconnected the interconnection has to be understood and there cannot be any uh department separately looking after strategy that is not the right way to do it 